An update tonight, local scientists helped help discover a new species of whale uncovered right here in the Gulf of Mexico. ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane is getting a closer look at the new find and learning why scientists say it is bittersweet. It's hard to believe that something so enormous is in the water around Florida and we don't even know it. Just how big? Well, here's the size of me compared to it. It has all of us scratching our head. It's, it's an amazing, amazing discovery. An amazing discovery that started in 2019 when this whale carcass washed up on Sandy Key in the Everglades. At first, it was assumed to be a Brutus whale. But we thought there might be a potential that it could be this new species. So most scientists joined with FWC and NOAA in moving the whale to Fort DeSoto, where it was buried to decompose so scientists could later dig it up to better study the bones. After the excavation, they learned it is indeed a brand new species, now called a rice's whale, after the scientists who first discovered it. Uh, definitely gives you pause, like what else is out there that we don't know about? They also say the new species is critically endangered. They believe there's less than 40 left. Sort of a gut punch to think that, you know, I had my hands on potentially 5 to 10% of the population. It's, it's a hard pill to swallow. And its biggest threat is us. Scientists say they believe the whale died from a piece of plastic no bigger than this lid that was lodged in the whale's stomach, inevitably causing its death. Scientists say it's a reminder of why it's so critical to keep our oceans clean. It's also hard when you know that there might not be, be very many of them left. Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.